over the past thirty years natural disasters storms floods and droughts have increased three fold according to the un's international strategy for disaster reduction when extreme weather strikes the poor are usually hit hardest tropical storms floods and droughts account for seventy five percent of all disasters Vietnam is one of the most natural disaster prone countries in the world. Typhoons and violent storms are frequent, eight in 2006, with often calamitous consequences. The country's entire 3,000 kilometer coastline is low lying and vulnerable. In Mangrove trees are planted along the coast to protect vulnerable communities as well as their dikes, shrimp farms, and rice fields. Over a hundred kilometers of coastline have been planted with the trees since 1994. Today the planting extends over a kilometer into the sea. The mangroves act like a giant breakwater. Storm waves are reduced to harmless ripples by the time they reach the coastal sea dikes. Among the roots of the mangroves, shrimp, crab and fish thrive, attracting the attentions of local fishermen. Although the pickings are easy in the mud at low tide, tree roots can be easily damaged. At high tide, these roots become invisible, but fishermen persist. Guards based out at sea monitor the activities of these fishermen. Bui Van Song is one of these. They damage the roots of the trees when they are digging around for shrimp, and this kills the trees. Now, even fish stocks have increased. And although Tan Tan is now protected by three kilometers of mangroves, two kilometers of nearby coastline remain unprotected. Here, diggers are busy rebuilding the dike after damage caused by a recent storm. Adverse conditions in this section of coastline have meant repeated attempts to plant mangroves have failed farms here are at risk but man must work with nature to strengthen its immune system against the effects of climate change and extreme events